Hi, I'm Jack, and I like video games. And as always, is with me is my lovely wife, Katie. Hello. And our animals around here, too. They're making lots of noise. So, we're going old school today. Katie's driving, and uh, she is going to be playing some Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. I'm not entirely sure why I... Actually, that's a lie. I know exactly why I started with the second game. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but it probably won't make sense to you. I just... Uh, I didn't get uh, the first game on PlayStation. I never had it. So my family started on the second game. Um, and so that's kind of, it's very nostalgic for me. And I was playing it and I just thought it might be cool to uh, to film it and yeah, show you guys my old Aww. school Harry Potter game. <laughs> <laughs> so I completely skipped the Dursleys, which is... Uh, yeah, uh, screw that noise. I thought it might have been cool to see like Escape from Dursleys, which was actually a... Uh, nope. um, is that Hedwig? That's Hedwig. Um, Escape from Dursleys was actually a game um, on the old Harry Potter site when, like, every year, the um, Warner Brothers would update the site and include games, like Flash games, mm -hmm. that were related to uh, the film that came out that year or, or you know, whenever. Uh, and so I played Escape from Dursley's, which was this side-scrolling game. Yeah, it was side-scroller. And you just flew the car, and it was essentially like Flappy Bird, but, <laughs> really? but with, the, with the blue car, and you just went, uh, is making hi, Uday. You just went like up and down and, you know, had to like, so you had to be invisible to like, I think there was a button you had to hit when you were going near, um... Near muggles? Mm hmm Yeah, so... Heaven forbid. So they're already in their Hogwarts robes. That's, oh, this, so there's Fred and George. Very and presumptuous. Ron. So here is Ron. Who, whipping who I just... some magic at his face, that's rough. So you already have, uh, your wand, um when you start this game, because it's obviously year two, but you can do magic. Oh, that was an accident. Oh, you got a bean. I got a bean. So. So you have to collect Birdie Bot's beans. Every flavor of beans. Yeah, and you trade them with Fred and George at Hogwarts. Um, but again, we're breaking the decree of underage wiz wizardry. Yeah, that makes no sense at all. Um, so we're at the burrow. I don't remember case. the farm oh. part of the burrow. Like, I don't remember so, having a barn. I, although I do remember Mr. Weasley had the, uh, he had his, like, his, uh, kind of like, I guess it was a shed or something, mm -hmm. where he had, like, his magical devices. So, I'm glad that you brought that up. The other reason that I love this game so much is because it actually incorporates a lot of things from the books that they never put into the films. So, this being one of them. Uh -huh. um, in the books, Harry had to, one of my favorite, favorite parts, actually, of the whole Harry Potter universe are, uh, gnomes. So, uh, <laughs> D in, in this book, in the Chamber of Secrets, uh, so, sorry, just to interrupt, this is a remember all. If that flashes, it means that I've got a task. So you oh. just hit select and... Meet him in the barn. Hey, now. Meet him in the barn for some good old Weasley time. Um, <laughs> so, uh, they, they have to... Harry has to help them denome the garden. Okay. And the book describes the gnomes as these little... Um, I'm looking for things to shoot. As these little potatoes with legs. Oh. And they curse at you. Oh, no. I hate when this happens. Welcome to, oh, to PlayStation yeah, 2. Yeah, to 12-year-old <laughs> video game. Uh, yeah, this came out in, in 2002, so this is a pretty oh, old 14 year 14-year-old video game. Uh, and so you can see inside the Desert's Kitchen. And if you look up, it's actually... Can you see what's her name? Jenny poking out at you? Yeah. No. Also, the control, Hello, Harry. We figured out that we hate the controls in this game. Yeah, the controls are that. terrible in this game. Awesome. So Ron supposedly lives on that very top floor. But... Yeah, so uh, the gnomes in the book is described uh, are described as um, potatoes with legs, essentially, uh, like a potato head. Excuse me, with like little arms and legs, and they they have like thick accents and they swear at you and they grumble and it's like one of my favorite parts of the of the second book. <laughs> so I'm, I love this part of the game for that reason. So R one R. Then hit flip players. Nintendo. Flip Nintendo. Flip Nintendo. Uh, and then they run headlong at you, which is also one of my favorite things, that he's running away. I wish you could zoom in on it. It was just so funny. They're like, I guess, little Shreks, if Shrek was, Oh, he's uh, making, he's like, ah-ha. Uh -huh. oh, oh, can we zoom? Can you see him? Yeah, cool. yeah he's a little potato. <laughs> um, oh, that magic door opened. A magic door, but they're just, I don't know, I think they're adorable. And they're very underrepresented in the Harry Potter, uh... Um, visual universe. Well, there's a lot of stuff they cut out from the movies that were in books. Hey, rubber well, ducky. Well, yeah, so, and there's a lot of Easter eggs in here, right? Mm -hmm. Like, so there's a the rubber ducky. He's like, tell me, Harry, what exactly is the function of a rubber duck? Um, so we got wow, some very butts being... Lots of them. Lots and there's also collectibles in this game, so there are oh, wizard cards. Yes, so... Which you 
you're very serious about your wizard cards. <laughs> um, so I, I'm not sure if I have like an addiction to collecting things, but I think when it comes to Harry, I'm trying to get the second thing that coils. There we go. The uh, Harry Potter things. I've I've just always been a hoarder of Harry Potter things and merchandise, and and I used to cut pictures of um, Daniel Radcliffe or just like Harry Potter related things out of magazines and add them to like a notebook. Um, and so I have always wanted to collect all of the wizard cards. Um, There's a lot of wizard cards. And there are 101 wizard cards. Our cat is being a punk ass. Ellie's been knocking stuff off of our shelves and whatnot lately. Yeah. That's she, her new thing that she does. She's also really into stealing my hair elastic. Ah, whoa. Really into stealing my hair elastic. Fire at it. Nintendo. Well, I'm trying. Why, why aren't you... You have to wait. Oh, you have to wait for it to be open? Yeah. Did you see that? Did you see my awesome skills? That was skills? impressive. Nintendo. Oh, that time he... Oh, no, he didn't get me. Did he get me? I don't know. I, I don't know. Oh, he's open. There we go. Boom. They tend to just leave, like, the whole game, they leave themselves open for attack. Like, that's the thing. It's like, just wait till they're angry and, like, rearing up and <laughs> then shoot them. But, so going back to wizard cards. So, there are 101 wizard cards. And I have made a spreadsheet. <laughs> um, and we got really, really close. Jack had to help me um, win some flying matches, which happened at, at, towards the end of the game, which hopefully, if you guys like this video, we'll get to. Um, otherwise, I'll just do it on my own. I don't need you. <laughs> um, uh, we got close. We were missing three that, uh, frustratingly enough, I left in the uh, Forbidden Forest. Oh, there's my chocolate frog. So there are chocolate frogs, too. You gotta hit him, knock them unconscious, and then eat them. No. Um, nom nom nom. Uh, so you can see the garden, and this is so much fun for me because I guess, especially being a Hufflepuff and just me in general, I'm just super into plants. And yes. And I just, I would love to see a wizard's garden. Like, and that's right, you... we, we are Hufflepuffs too, we should point that out. People have asked what houses that we're sorted into, and we are sorted into uh, the uh, the Hufflepuffs. Yeah. I thought I was a Ravenclaw, it turns out I was a Hufflepuff. Your sister is a Ravenclaw. Katie, have... th Katie thought she was a Gryffindor. She... I did, but I, I can see now that I'm not. I'm not showboaty enough. Like, I'm not, you know, I don't know. I think I'm brave, but kinda... a lot of Hufflepuffs are. It's just that Gryffindors I'm not... are kind of pompous. Yeah, they're kind of... Let's Gryffindor... be honest. Let's Gryffind... be honest. No offense, but Gryffindors and Slytherins, not that far apart. Ooh. Except for, like, the moral Except stuff. one is super evil. <laughs> yeah. And, but but bad wizards have come from Gryffindor, too. So, but the, the least amount of bad wizards come from Hufflepuffs. So. Alright, so you're chucking these gnomes out of the thing, right? Right. So, I made a spreadsheet about these, whoop. Oh, he's coming after you. Uh, I just, I want to like stand still so you can hear it. There it goes. <laughs> um, yeah, so wizard cards. I am obsessed with collecting them. Made a spreadsheet. We got three away. I accidentally left them in the Forbidden Forest when I was, oh, there it goes. When I was well, going to get... Uh, are you, why aren't you throwing them? Because I was talking. I wanted oh. to show the garden a little bit. Um, when I was going to get Aragog. Aragog? Aragorn. No, which one's Lord of the Rings? Aragorn, one? Is, Aragorn is Lord of the okay, Rings. Okay, Aragog. Is Aragog the one, uh, is the spider. <laughs> is the spider. He's the one that uh, I was going to visit. Oh, yeah. and By I the was... way, uh, there will be spoilers in this. If, uh, if you've never seen Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets oh, 14 yeah. years ago. Then so, you are um, going to... So, there are three wizard cards to be won in this... Oh, Oop. not from that one. There are three wizard cards to be won from this section. Sorry, bro. Um, Say bro. One of them is when I beat Fred uh, or George, whichever one did its record. The Wait second is the... Oh, wow, I look way to too early. I'm normally so good at this. I just suddenly got crappy at it. Well, you have pressure on you now. You have people watching. I do. And they're all like, Katie, you're terrible at this. I'm going to stop watching. Um, so, <coughs> yeah, the, if you hit the two targets. But I think I had to get Jack to help me do the two. There you go. Oh, Bang. So I should get... No, I should get one for that. There yeah. we go. So when I beat 125, I'll get one as well. So let's take wizard a look at card. our first wizard card. I guess the, fr the one frustrating thing about getting the wizard cards when you're on, like, the hunt for the wizard cards mm -hmm. is that every time he stops and goes... Wizard God, and then like pops it into non-existence. There are 101 wizard cards to be collected and traded. Increase your stamina bar with every 10 you collect. So we got Gregory the Smarmy, which I think you actually trade. So eventually, so I'll get two of him in this run. Um, and I like learning about it. That's the other cool thing, 
is so many. Uh, yeah, there's a lot of cool like information about all the different wizards and whatnot. Yeah, and I think that's really fun. And I know Pottermore is just kind of like the the wealth um, of the well of knowledge for that, or whatever that expression is. But um, well, uh, but I you know that didn't <clears throat> exist when I was playing this game, and so it was really fun for me to um, to get to experience. Whoa, 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 what did I? What happened there? Um, also, if you hit these trees, these ones here. Oh. They're hidden objects, so. Um, Whoa! You got Nintendo. I got Nintendo. Uh, I got Nintendo? Wait, no. <laughs> I think we call Flipendo Nintendo. <laughs> yes. So, Flipendo is sort of like the, the general attacking. So, what is, what is Flipendo typically? Um, like, do we ever do we ever hear Flipendo? And no, I don't know. I don't think so. Are you going for distance? Because um, no, I can't think of like. Oh, or... oh, nope. <coughs> oh, look out! Someone's coming for me. Uh, I don't. I don't know the answer to that. Um, I know Expelliarmus is one. Expelliarmus. Lumos is one. Lumos. Uh, what is the one that lights? Defendo is one. Uh, Alohomora is in there. Damn it, Alohomora is one. Oh, so I close. I keep hitting it like, uh, Alohomora, what else is there? What's the file? Incendio. Incendio is one. Incendio. Um. There they are. <coughs> did I get him? Um, I'm slowly dying right ah, now. Did I say Defendo already? I think so. I, know I, have, I feel like I have more than that. Alright, so you gotta hit the, the Scarecrow and this Chuck for distance. And that guy's watching. He's like, what? Oh, come on! I feel like I'm letting it go at a different time. This must be very frustrating. <laughs> come here. Bonk. Oh, oh, uh oh. Oh, God. What is happening? Oh, Bonk. got you. Watch it. Ooh. They're just so oh. funny. They're like little troll <laughs> things. It's just... Okay, don't let... Now. Oh, come uh, on. You got the sign again. This is so frustrating. I'm normally so... Like the first throw I beat this, the first time I picked this game up after, you know, yeah, 14 years. however many years it was. All right. Hey, I got some beans. All right, bro. I'm gonna try standing on Fred's stupid circle thing. Whoosh, whoosh. All right, Jackie, tell me when to let go. Ready, set. <laughs> what the actual? Okay. Oh, I beat it. So that's all that matters. Well, that's good. <laughs> like, I said, ready, set, and you just chopped <laughs> it. Just let like, go. All right. Um, we're done, and now Mrs. Weasel is gonna tell us to come in. But you need to get one more, right? Yeah, I want to hit the scarecrow because there are some there are some cards, which is what happened with the forest, that you can't go back and get. She's skinnier in the uh, in the game than she is in the movies. No, I don't think so. She looked like it. Was she even there? I didn't even. Yeah, see. she was. She was standing on the edge there. Right, we'll see her at Di Diagon Alley. I think that she's diagonally. <laughs> and that's the other thing. Also, is uh, it kind of stays true to the um, that the, there's a guy that narrates it. Excuse me. If Harry Potter goes back to Hollywood. <laughs> yeah, that way he will be in mortal danger. No, he's not American. He's British. What was I thinking? <laughs> whipping spells at Fred and George. They ain't nothing to I it. I love hitting Ron with spells because it's like, Harry! Harry, why would you, Harry? That's funny. And Such Hermione's so pompous in this, it's funny. She's pompous in the movies, too. Oh my gosh, I've just realized I have to go to the library. It's like, oh, geez, all right, Hermione. Go, hit the... No, okay. No, nope, a little short. I did a great job. I don't know what you're talking about. You're obviously Bonk. not seeing what I'm seeing. All right, going for the scarecrow. Going for the scarecrow. Oh, uh, yeah, also I should preface that... Uh, preface? Yeah, anyway. That Jack will also be um, assisting me in this endeavor. Oh, will I? I think you're maybe... Oh, oh, oh! A little overshot. Oh, my gosh, that was so good! A little overshot there. You went, oh, oh he knocked you down. Like, look how pompous he is. He's just like, yeah, yeah, yeah I got you. It's funny. Oh, what? There we go. Uh-huh. Mm. Wizard smug. Who got who? But in the book, it's really funny. He's probably a Slytherin. Because they, douche. like, use swear words at you, and it's really funny. Okay, you got this. Don't you got to throw it, like, in the second or third one, like now. There oh, we are. Bonk. Nice. I did all three on my own. No, you did. I am very proud of myself right now. You are really good at this game. <laughs> it's probably the only game I'm good at, which is why I threw the controller at the wall. 
uh, when I was losing. <laughs> uh, we can't lose in the game. Um, the wall so, can lose, apparently. The wall can lose that. So Jesus. I'm not going to go back in. Um, the remember rule comes up and it says press X to end day. Um, but I know that there is a wizard card to Whoa. be out of up here. You sneaky monkey. So I'm going to... Harry just... See, this is at camera angles again. Like I have no oh, idea yeah. what I'm doing. Um, the giant card. How anyone can miss that. What? Was it Flitwick? Or was it... Um, McGonagall's. One of the challenges for the spells, because you have to, because Harry alone has to go on these epic adventures to get yeah. these spells, and they're all like, Harry Potter, come forward, please. And Harry's like, yeah? And they go, do you accept the challenge? And he's like, ugh, yeah, I guess. And like, he actually sounds like that. He's like, seriously, you're picking me? And then he goes and has to do like an epic fight against multiple things. And there's this it's like the worst teachers ever. Right. <laughs> like we're gonna like, put our students in mortal danger. If you live, you deserve the spell. Um, Alright, what's next? Um Did you get it all? I think so. I'm pretty sure I have, but I'm nervous. Should I look it up online? Uh yes. Actually. I should have it open. Are you on mine? No, I'm not. Mm. Rookie mistake. If you go to my email, it should be up in my Google Drive. Um, I have a spreadsheet. Okay, so we have school records, which show you nothing right now. Um, but you can check it as things progress. Uh, but my favorite is Folio Magi. I have Elfrida Clagg, um, Chieftainess of the Warlocks Council. Um. Merlin. Most famous wizard of all time. Oh, is he number one? He is number uno. Let me log in as you. Derwent Shimple. I'm not going to do this for... Actually, maybe... I no, I don't know. Anyway. Which which one am I logging in as? I have one more. I think I got four, right? So, um... Is it this one? Uh-huh. 59. Gregor and this mommy. That's right. Okay, so I have four. I'm pretty sure that's all I need for this. I'm almost positive that that's all I need for this. And when I hit, uh... When I hit X, it's just going to go into um, some narration. Mm. Why won't I let you do it? Oh, because I'm signed in like four different accounts right now. Mm. Yeah. That'll do it. All right, but it's fun. I like looking over in the distance. The graphics were like pretty awesome for their time. Oh, I can look over my shoulder. Is it Harry Potter? Um, so in the book, yes. In the book, um, when Harry leaves to go back inside, he can see the gnomes uh, sneaking through the hedge and going back into the Weasley's yard. So I thought that was pretty nice. I don't know. So if you go to the second... Oh, you little punk. Oh, there we go. Let's go see. to the second tab. Okay, yeah, there are only four. All right, you're good. Cool. You got it? So this pumpkin pasty will uh, add to my health. Nice. Uh, so it extends your health bar? No, no, it just refills it. Just a little. Oh, so that's okay. when, when we were fighting the spider, which I blatantly gave up on and gave to you the second time. Oh, no, the first time, actually. Um, because I couldn't see it. I couldn't work out the camera angles. That's what was coming down, and you hit oh. it. Okay, pumpkin pasty. So, looks right. good. Let's take one last look at the burrow. It's lovely. Aww. It's not as tall in this as it is in the movies. No, a lot of the buildings don't make um, don't make a whole lot of sense in there. Wow. Like Hogwarts is so small in comparison, but so remember all says you've forgotten something. Press X in the day. day. So I'm pretty in love with this game. <laughs> um, and I start to kind of like get super into it uh, once we get to Diagon Alley. My, my one thing is that I wish um, Diagonally. That's where he nearly breaks his elbow. So, um, the one thing that I wish that they'd done is have uh, Green Gods, but I guess in the second movie, in the second, um, in Chamber of Secrets, he doesn't really, uh, he doesn't really does he go to Green Gods? Go the to Green Gods. I don't think so. Yes, he does. He does, excuse me, because he's with, I'm pretty sure, and I can be corrected, but I'm pretty sure that. They go 
and Mrs. Weasley stop at Mrs. Weasley's vault first and she goes in and picks up like one gallon that they have left and like a silver just like there's she cleans out their vault there's nothing left in oh it. yeah but then they go then to they Harry's, go to Harry's, and, Harry's like, oh, and he has you're tons of money super loaded did I tell you I found out why he's rich mm. his great 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 grandfather pretty sure it's fourth or fifth um, invented the potions that they use for um, Skelligro, oh. which is what grew back scary scaries it grew back Scary's arm. <laughs> grew back Harry's arm in this movie. Oh, yeah. So he didn't invent <coughs> Skelly Grow, but he invented something that they use in those. Oh. And then his son did something else that made them lots of money, too. But I forget what it was. So, like, so the, the potters were loaded? Yeah, he was actually rich, and I oh. didn't know that. I thought that all wizards just had that much money. Well, we but... never really hear about, like, Harry's grandparents, mm-hmm. right? Like, James, James's dad and mom? Nope, but... Um, or even Lily's, or, uh, yeah, Lily's. You kind of learn a little bit about her, um... Through... Like her, her sister hates her. Right, but Petunia. you but you learn about her through Snape's memories. I when guess Harry so, yeah. goes in and, and he... He learns about her, and you right. also know that like her relationship with Petunia is uh, isn't good through her in the letter that she writes to Sirius that time. All right, so there are two in here. Mm-hmm. There's one in the alley just outside the Duh! shop, and one found in the attic. Mm-hmm. So I'm doing? pretty sure my my objective is just to hide in this thing. I don't think that's no, it's not it's not on yet. What is that? Oh, is Mr. that the Mr. Malfoy? <coughs> what a pleasure. Um, yeah, so I, he, he had very successful um, predis, predecessors. Mm-hmm. Very successful. So that's why he had so much money left to him. Mr. Morgan. Hey, it's Snoke what from... A pleasure uh, to see you. <laughs> from Force Awakens. He says, again. Yeah, he's not as nearly as cool looking as... Uh, well, where'd the book come from? He... Just, I like that Lumos is the thing that is uh, is going to embarrass him. No wonder Malfoy grew up to be such a bad Look how happy person. Malfoy looks. He's like, yay, well, I'm it's off with my dad. If you think about the psychology behind a lot of these characters, like, and the, the family that Snape grew up in, um, you know why he turned into such a jerk. Oh, oh, magic. Creepy Harry. If I could just get past the hand. All right. So that hand goes bonkers when I go near it. So um, what do you have to do? Should I show people that it goes bonkers, or should I just? You should just go. Okay, good. Because I don't. We should try to beat this thing. All right. My goal is to get all of the cards. That is why I'm here, with you today. <laughs> so when I hit uh, R two and R one, I can see around corners. But I'm going to go this way. Actually, I don't think this helps me at all. Ring So you're going to get the book. All right. So now I have to creep. Creepy, creepy. Because I creep. Yeah. I'm a creep. Thanks yeah, for telling me after yeah, I already yeah. did it. Can you say, were you creeping? Oh, these camera okay. angles can throw me off. Pick, Pick it up. up. Yay. Can you say? You're very cute. I'm surrounded by magic in some creepy place, so paused- and it's inserting itself into me. <laughs> That's cool. I've paused it um, several times and tried to remember, uh, tried to read the runes. I'm like, what am I doing? I don't wow, know how to read really? runes. Um, okay, so you can equip it, equip, equip, equip it. it to... Um, yes, Kuse, I understand that you're here. Right, right. So we don't have... Um, the strength to keep things. Ah! Whoa! He's freaking so out, that's man. That's what he does. All right, so now I need to go to the oh, wait, attic. To nope. Anything in there? I think there's one that I can check. Is it this one? Yeah, this is one. Hello. My name is Elder. Oh look, Price. I'm just stealing from the shop. That's cool, Harry Potter. Well, the you boy know. who thiefed. The boy who thiefed. Okay, so there should be. One so, in here. Oh my one in the alley and then one on the roof. Uh, it, it's very dull. It's very dull. Oh, it's a magic wall. Hello. My name is Elder Price, and I would like to share with you the most amazing book. <laughs> I've been singing um, the song from Cannibal the Musical all day. No, oh, which one? Um, Safe as an island, far across <laughs> the sea. 
perhaps I'm not the cold. Sorry, <laughs> that was inappropriate. <laughs> Pretended to. Well, uh -oh. I thought I, I thought I was. No. I'm... What is that? Is like that's not a goblin. No, it's an imp. Oh. Which are annoying. Punk. And if I stand exactly here, I will never be hit by a boss. That's funny. So, and it's it's exactly where I'm put, like, in the game. Uh, after the animation finishes. So the key is not to move. Just don't move. <laughs> and this music really, like, gets under my skin after you've played it for a few hours. Because um, the game's... It's not, like, really quick, but it's it's a relatively simple playthrough. Um, but after I am like have lost a few times, th that music just is... Yeah, you hear the same stuff over and over and over again. And it's like, haha, you're losing. Let's all be excited about you losing. And I'm just like, ugh. Whoa, okay, so there whoa. is, I think, is there one in here? No, it's a little... There's one in the back, in I the alley next to it, and okay. there's one in the attic. Is this the attic? Mm, oh, yeah. That was successful. Oof. I was trying to edge off it, but there's an imp somewhere. I gotta put him in his place. There he is. Oh, you little punk. Wait. In the cage. Oh. <laughs> Boop. Oh. Yeah. So I accidentally had to start the game again because there's a part in. Um... Oh, I gave you a thing. Yay. Let what is this, the attic? Finish. I guess so. Is this dim for ferment? Wait, no. In the in the attic, is it by the floorboards? Um. Because I know there's one that you have to there's get. There's one found in the alley near the shop. Which one is this? This is Daisy Dodgeridge. Daisy Dodgeridge. First lady. Uh, this one doesn't. That's not what it says here. Where are you? Okay, and we're back. Uh, yeah, we just realized that we didn't, totally don't have webcam. <laughs> <laughs> it froze and we, we didn't notice. Yeah. So anyway, so next ones will have webcam, and uh, oh, chocolate frog. Yay! Um, we were just trying to figure out um, where I got the card from, um, because on my notes it says that I'm not supposed to get it till I get to Hogwarts. Yet here we are. So where are we? Uh, we are in what is that? A creepy looking thing. Oh, that's uh, Hedwig's thing. So we're actually in. The, um, I guess the attic of sorts. Of, um, nope, not the side. I can't get off. Wow, that was such an enormous leap. Where is the He's thing? He's gonna take a massive leap. Where is the thing? Where what are you we? looking for? Oh, here it is. Uh, of, um, uh -huh. Nocturne Alley. We're in Borgen and Bucks, essentially, where he has all those creepy stuff, but we're in Nocturne Alley. So somewhere in here there is a crate. Uh, it's a creepy chest. skull. Chest. Creepy screaming skull. Just rooting around Owl through stuff and again. Owl That's... tree. He does what he wants. He's Harry Potter, don't you know? <laughs> He's the chosen one. You don't know anything. I am the boy who stole. Uh, I am there. <laughs> Harry uh, sometimes likes to jump off things for no apparent reason. So oh, yeah. We like yeah, to we call figured him that out. The boy who dies. Nice, That's tragically. Not just like the boy who falls, the boy who trips, the boy who like just calling him all kinds of things. Hedwig likes to just come, you know, at random times and save the day. He's like, what's up? I'm Hedwig. <laughs> I'm white. Elops uh, premium owl treat. Hey, you. Creepy. Creepy, creepy. So, um, nom, 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 nom. <laughs> so he's like, oh, a treat? Cool. I know just what to do. <laughs> Goes and drops a ladder for you. Um, Thanks, Hedwig. But once we get out of the... Once we get out also, of this... Also, is this the attic, maybe? That we're going into? Is that the alley? Well, mm, no. The alley has one. I've, see, I've found the alley one. Oh, so is there um, one in here somewhere? There is one in here, yes. So we got an extra one somehow. Okay. So oh. oh, I hate the camera for this... No more. For this particular spot because when you fall through like when you get further along it's like really frustrating so they're magic fake wood planks that's a dick move yep you lumos oh oh do you're fine you're fine and i swear so much and i have to be like really conscious not to <laughs> 
do that because maybe our nephews aren't here. Don't worry. Well, no, you know, I I want mm. it's Harry Potter. It's kind of PG until you get to you know the years yeah, that he doesn't PG. He, he gets older. <laughs> And he starts getting into girls. Yeah. He's all like, sub Cho Chang. I remember the... Oh, there's the chest over there. I'm pretty sure this is the way I walk. Whoa. Okay. What's up, Cho Chang? I like that he dumps her because she cries too much. <laughs> like, he's so... Such a, a teenage boy. Yeah. That he's like, I don't know what to do. She cries all the time. She has it's emotions. Like, she... She is a woman who lost her boyfriend and is very confused because you could have killed him and no one knows, but That's she true. likes you. Um, no one trusts you, Harry Potter. So Hermione's saying... We hear saying, you steal a bunch of stuff. <laughs> yeah. So, oh wait, which card did I get? So Hermione's saying that he has the emotional range of a teaspoon, or Ron does. It's very funny. So that's the one, right? That's the one found in the attic. Cool. So we got an extra one. So. Okay, so now we just need Gulliver Pokeby. Um, she was abducted by pixies in Cornwall. Ooh. Failed to persuade the Ministry of Magic to have all pixies humanely destroyed. How do you humanely destroy a pixie? Freshly cobbed Cornish pixies. Very, very politely cut their heads off. Mm, very politely Locked cut their heads off? Yeah. There's also a bunch of different dialogue. Because I like thinking about the voice actors that, um, that did all these characters. Um... And I, I like that every time I try to unlock a door, he says something different. And I just imagine the guy in the booth just saying, like, Oh, that one's locked! <laughs> just all the different things that he No, says. moron! Oh, this takes forever! Oh, sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. If you weren't little, what would happen? Oh, so this is the alley? Mm, this is the alley. Oh, you move that. Yep. I'll get back there. Oh, push it, and then I open the other door. And then... Convenient. Mm -hmm. But I mean, the graphics in this is really cool. Like, the colors and the shadows. And one of my favorite things to do is just fly around the grounds um, and look at my own shadow on the ground. The only glitch... In the game? Or? Yeah, in the, okay. in the game. <laughs> yeah, in real life, I wish. Uh, I just fly to Florida and just look at everybody and be like, Yeah, from Harry Potter world, I am in Harry Potter. I am Harry Potter <laughs> world. <laughs> yeah. Um, no, nice. the only glitch that I've encountered in the game, besides the one I purposely did, which we'll go into uh, later, is um, one of the races. Is that it? Yep, that's it. Go so we, got an, we got an extra one. Um, Weird. Magical birds. The augury song. See, I wonder if that bird is uh, in Newt's commander's fantastic piece and where to find them. Ooh. Uh, what was I saying? Oh yeah, there was a um, somebody that I was racing against in a flying competition was still in the sky when I finished it. And they were like frozen oh, mid-flight. Yeah. And I was flying around when I was bumping into them and they were really hey. there. Hey, what are you doing? What are you doing? You flying? You, you, you flying? It's cool. What's up? Emma, I wasn't talking to you. Don't crash. Don't fall. Don't Emma, fall. Emma, you wish you could fly. Emma, I don't know. Emma doesn't like being picked up, let alone That's true. flying, so... All right, let's venture in. So now you're heading to Diagon Alley? Yeah. So should we do the rest of uh, Diagon Alley and then finish it up? Already like uh, 40 minutes or so in? Let's finish it up. Let's let's wrap it up now, like as, okay. we, as we go into. Just because then finishing up Diagon Alley actually goes for a little while because you have to collect all of Ginny's things that she lost in the fireplace. And then you have to go into... Uh, oh, Ginny. You have to go into... Um, the other cool thing, just uh, sorry, let me finish my, my first thought. Sorry, I'm so excited. I love Harry Potter. Uh, Nerd. You have to go into the Leaky Cauldron attic basement place oh, okay. area. So, and that takes a little while. But my other favorite thing is this is actually in uh, Harry Potter World. You can go down here oh, yeah. where you go down um, some stairs and there's like a creepy shop on the side here. It's a little different because they've actually got more stuff. Um, if you turn the corner, they have more going on here. Um, as opposed to just having that thing there, but this Can you exists. go inside of Morgan and Burks right now? Okay. No, but I will show you. So I don't even think it's labeled. What was that labeled. extra card? Uh, the Spiny Serpent. What was the extra? Oh, it just might be that there isn't... Uh, so these things are here, and they've got stuff in the window that you can activate if you have a... Magic wand. Yeah. If you have a uh, interactive if anyone wand. from Universal is watching... Hey, look. Oh, I didn't mean to activate that. Oh, no. That's okay. We'll recap later. So, yeah, if anyone from Universal is watching and wants to uh, 
give us a VIP tour of Harry Potter World, we will gladly accept it. I am the biggest fan. Everyone else will tell you that they're, big, they're the biggest fan, but they're all lying. See, I'm, I'm a fan of looking all behind the scenes stuff, like figuring out how stuff works. I am and not Katie a fan just wants to be engrossed in magic. <laughs> So you can show Katie all the magic stuff, and then I'll be like, "Okay, show me, show me the IR uh, detectors, and where where are the R and RFIDs?" You are the worst for that yeah. because we uh, went to. Um, I was, I'm the worst for some things, but you are the worst for that. Where you're like super excited, you're like, "Oh wow, this is a oh fast silver sickle, which is enormous, by the way." You're all like, "Oh wow, this is really cool. What's the technology behind it?" And you're like, "Look, you can see the camera right there." I'm like, "Jack, god damn it!" <laughs> like, it was like real magic until you set that. Until I ruined it with reality. I'm they sorry. Give you, they give you, when you buy an interactive one, they give you... Um, <laughs> he just brushed that woman off. He, like, he, nope, not moving. No, he does this thing that if you leave him long enough, he turns around and he's like, what are you doing? Hurry oh. up and walk forward. I won't, I won't wait until you see it. Um, no, you do this thing where uh, <laughs> he's playing with his wand. <laughs> it's leaking. J.K. Rowling once said that um, she an interviewer told her that um, Fifty Shades of Grey had surpassed Harry Potter in book sales, and uh, the lady interviewing her said, how does that make you feel? And J.K. Rowling very coolly said, well, it just makes me wonder how much money I could have made had Harry been a little more creative with his wand. <laughs> and uh, I thought it was the coolest, most like awesome thing that someone could say. Um, All right, so moral of the story is I ruin everything for you. Yes. Everything. I ruin magic. You still believe... And we have to go to Universal. Oh, and also, there will be a webcam in the next episode. Sorry if you're expecting one tonight. We were expecting Or today, one. whenever you're watching this. So, yeah. That is why. Hooray, technology. See, I need to figure out how it works. All right. So, you want, you want to say goodbye? You want to wrap it up? So, on next episode. On next episode? On the next episode. <laughs> this is Grand Gods, by the way. Ooh. Uh, on the next episode, we will finish Diagon Alley, most probably, definitely. Um, and then, uh, yeah, that's that's pretty much it. We'll check it out and see see how we oh, do. you're making me dizzy. Sorry. But, yeah, I'm super excited. I Even if you don't like these, I'll probably still keep making them because it's an excuse to play Harry Potter. But I do have the other games as well. So if, uh, if you guys do like this, then um, then I'll probably play the others as well. For some nostalgia, we it's can all share. Old school PS2 Let's Plays. Mm -hmm. Not many people do this because mm -hmm. the resolution is terrible. <laughs> thank you for my Christmas present. Oh, yeah, yeah. I got this for Katie for Christmas. Mm -hmm. So anyway. Yeah. All right, so that's it. Uh, feel free to watch more, subscribe, all that other stuff. Bye. And uh, we will see you next time for more. Harry says bye. Pew, pew, pew.